Yes guys again welcome to my new video here and in this video I'll be going to show you how you can play FIFA 17 in low end PCs or if you have a dual core processor which is not compatible with FIFA 17 so first of all let me show you by opening FIFA 17 in the dual core processors the FIFA 17 game settings program will open but when you click on play game it will appear in the background process process in task manager but you can't actually see where is the game running so I'm going to tell you how you can fix this so let's just wait for the f game settings program to appear here So, just a few seconds, and the game setting files will appear here. here. So, here when I click on play, it will show that something is going on. The cursor will show that something is going on, but nothing pops up. Then, when you click on Task Manager, and you go down here you see FIFA 17 demo running in the background processes so but you can't actually see as you can see nowhere so I'm gonna tell you how you can fix this this is because of your processor is not compatible with it but you'll be able to play if you don't have enough RAM the game will stuck or lag so just end this task and then close this program and then you have to download this three files I'll give the link in the descri description so after downloading you just open the file location of FIFA 17 demo and just copy and paste these three files in this folder copy and paste these three files in the folder and then exit this and then open the extreme injector program and then as you can see here I have this already done but I'll show you again here in the process name you should type FIFA 17 demo stuff FIFA 17 underscore demo dot exe so then you have to click on add DLL and then go to the origin game FIFA 17 demo folder and just select the dual code DLL folder and click on open here you can see then go to settings and click select this auto inject option and then click on ok then close this program so after that you have to just open the FIFA 17 demo and just a few seconds it signed into origin and then when the game settings program opens up you have to again open the extreme in injector application so that to it to work properly and effectively on the FIFA 17 here you go before click on clicking on play just open the extreme in injector app click on yes and then just click on play after that wait some seconds to to load and here we go guys here you can please like and subscribe and peace out